My name is Jared Callahan and I am the first assistant director on I Am Not a Hipster, which premiered this year at Sundance 2012. It's a feature film about an indie musician from San Diego, California, who's dealing with the death of, the death of his mother and uh, trying to figure out how he can continue to perform when his family shows up for a surprise visit. Our group of friends really feels like a family. We've been making short films for about eight years together. Um, and so everybody knows the responsibilities and expectations on set and really by the time we have done all the work to get onto the movie set everybody just feels like we're one big family so it's been fun to as actors come in that have never worked with us before they quickly realize that it's not a regular film set and that it's a group of friends making a movie and so they get invited into the vibe it's really fun um, we've done a number of short films together we had a short film here in Sundance in 2009 that won Grand Jury Prize uh, called Short Term 12 and so it was from that movie that we uh, made some money and raised some money to make the movie I'm Not a Hipster this year. Normally we film our short films in three days or four days and then on this film uh, once we hit day three or four we realized that we had 16 more days to shoot and so that was the only thing that really changed between shooting a short and a feature. You just have to do it for a lot longer and it takes a lot more work. The title of the movie I'm Not a Hipster came from a line that used to be in the movie. It was written in and we shot it and then it got edited out. Um, but really it's a musician who is totally immersed in the land of hipster culture, um, but he himself would probably deny that he was a hipster. So uh, it's been fun to listen to like 55 year old women on the bus ask what a hipster is and then try and explain it to them. And you start by explaining that it's skinny jeans and uh, thrift store clothing, but then you get down to it. It's art culture being snobby and what that means. So I think that hopefully if you watch the movie, I'm not a hipster, you'll realize that some of those stereotypes are broken down through the movie. Well, the first time we got in, I, I, I immediately went into his, like, hysteria. I just ran around screaming. And then this year, I kind of went into shock. I heard, and I didn't know if they were pulling a prank on me or if it was for real. And so I just kind of was in shock for a while. And then about 15 or 20 minutes later, realized what they had said was true and started calling people and called my mom and said, Mom, we got into Sundance. And I don't think she has any clue what that is. She chose to go to my high school brother's crab feed this weekend over coming to Sundance. Yeah, some people don't get it, I guess. but. Yep, yeah, it's, cra it's crazy, it's a really wild experience. Hi, my name is Jared Callahan and I'm the assistant director on I Am Not A Hipster. I'm here with the Elon Sundance Experience crew and they are awesome, Amanda, they are just the best interview I've done all week, so uh, they represent, woo woo, I'm not a hipster.